television from the studios of Alexander Pett. Yesterday, December 7th, 1941, a date which will live in infamy. They will still say, this was their final hour. Sir William Crookes was a highly respected physicist in the Victorian era. Crooks not only attended dark mirror rituals at the Golden Dawn, but was also a leading member of the Society for Psychical Research. Sir William Crooks had invented several devices which could measure the existence of tiny elementary particles, such as electrons. Sir William Crooks believed that spirits in the ether were capable of moving small primary particles such as electrons and protons. William Crookes developed the cathode ray tube, the most important element to a modern television, firing billions of electrons at a glass screen covered in phosphorus. These pioneering experiments produced amorphous, fuzzy speckles on a glass screen. By staring at the cathode ray tube image, Crookes realized that spirits might somehow be invoked to arrange these particles into an image of the spirit world. Crookes experimented with the cathode ray tube and placed a Maltese cross inside it and bombarded it with streams of electrons. The Maltese cross is an ancient emblem used by magicians, Kabbalists, royal Satanists, Nazis and the infamous American Phi Beta Kappa secret society. Crookes managed to project a shadowy image at the other end of the cathode ray tube, which was the first ever electrically created image known to man. In his memoirs, Sir William Crookes said that it might be possible for spirits to influence streams of tiny particles. Sir William Crookes would go on to become president of the Society for Psychical Research and inspired Sir Oliver Lodge's research into the ether and the spirit world. The Crookes version of the cathode ray tube would become the most fundamental component in the development of television devised 40 years later by the Scotsman John Logie Baird. Television, an invention which would eventually enslave and hypnotize the entire world, was inspired in part by research into the spirit world. <laughs> 